watching the Brian Ansley, Brian Ansley, um, and he's training a week out from Arnold right now. <clears throat> he's talking about doing ballet in it, and I'm sitting there thinking like, yeah, of course. You know, not only should you be awarded on you know the aesthetics, the mass, the symmetry, the balance, but the um, aesthetic flow of the locomotion in the performance. You know, we work out this vessel. But then you have, I don't know, 9 out of 10 dudes stepping on stage and it looks like they're holding a water gun or something. Like they have absolutely no flow, you know, no finesse. And like, I, you know, props to Brian, Brian, excuse me. I'm sorry for mispronouncing that. Props to Brian because um, it should be awarded just like Kai, you know, wins the posing round. It's absolutely a part of bodybuilding. So... You know, you know, it takes me back to like Samir Banu. <clears throat> Samir was asked like, oh, like, where did you learn your posing and stuff? You know, it's, it's tremendous. It's alive. It's raw. Um, you know, it's not quite a Lee Labrada, but it's one in your own. And he, he's guilty of never even posing. You know, it's just his natural flow. You can tell it translated directly into his workouts. Um, you know what? I'm sure when he was, you know, it'd be a marvel to be watching these cats when they're doing bent over, you know, barbell rows um, pre-competition, um, standing on, picture yourself standing on top of a bench, a barbell bench, sitting, standing at the end of it, you know, like, uh, Spider-Man at the top of a building, and he's, he's creating a work of art because he's singling out his back on this barbell row, and he's achieving muscular failure, not mechanical failure, that's a fact. And in doing so, and in sticking to the same exercises, day in and day out, you do achieve perfection through practice, and therefore you achieve your own style in what you do best. <clears throat>